Little Black, A Pony by Walter Farley. When I was little, I had a pony. I called him Little Black. He was my very, very good friend. The two of us went all over the farm. We had fun. We went to see the other horses. We saw Big Red. My, that horse could run. Then one day I said, Little Black, I would like to try to ride Big Red. So I went to the barn. I looked at Big Red. Could I ride this horse? Could I ride this big horse? I could. I could ride Big Red. It was fun. All my friends stopped to look at me. I went by Little Black, but he would not look at me. Soon I began to jump Big Red. This horse could do everything. We jumped and jumped. But when I went by Little Black, his head was down. He looked sad. Then one day I took Big Red out for a long ride. What a day, what a time we had. Little Black came running right after us. He could not keep up with us. He tried, but he was too little. He could not run as fast as Big Red. We went on and on. A big tree was in the way. Big Red jumped right over the tree. To him, it was just a hop. It was not just a hop to Little Black. He tried it. He tried to jump over the tree. But Little Black could not jump that high. Down he went. His leg was stuck. It was stuck in the tree. Oh, Big Red, I said, my pony wants so much to do everything you do. Look at him. His leg is stuck. He can't get up. We must go back. We must help him. Come on. I took hold of the tree. I had to pull and pull and pull. It took a long time. At last, I got his leg out. Then I talked to Little Black. Please don't try to do everything Big Red does. He's a big horse. You're only a little pony. You could get hurt. I talked and talked to him. I wanted him to be happy, but he did not look at me. He just looked sad. So I was sad too. Days went by. Then I took Big Red out, <clears throat> Big Red out again. Little Black came along too, but he did not hold his head up. He did not hold his tail up. He just looked sad. We went down by the river. I was, it was so hot. I, I sat down under a tree. Big Red went into the water. He went way out. There the water went very, very fast. Little Black put two feet in the water. Was he going to do just what Big Red did? Was he going out in the fast water too? <clears throat> Come back here, Little Black, I said. You could get hurt. I took hold of him. I pulled him back. You can't go out there. The water is too fast for you. Don't try to do it. Just what Big Red does. He's a big horse. You're just a little pony. After that day, Little Black was more and more sad. He would not look up when I went to see him. I guess he thought he was no good at all. He did not eat very much. When I tried to give him apples, he would not eat them. This made me very sad. Little Black was my friend. I wanted him to be happy. One morning, it was very cold. Just as the sun came up, I looked out. There was Little Black, my friend, my good little pony, was running away. I had to get him back. I ran to the barn 
and jumped on Big Red. Hurry, hurry, I said. We must go and get my pony. We went out of the barn fast. We could see Little Black's tracks in the snow. On and on we ran in the snow. We went right along the tracks of Little Black. But I could not see him. Little Black, I called. Please come back. I love you more than any horse. Then we came to the river. The river was all ice. Big Red did not like the look of that ice. He stopped. Come on, I said to Big Red. Little Black is over there in the trees. He went over the ice. You can too. Come on, try it. He did try it. But the ice did not hold Big Red. Crack! Splash! Down I went. Down I went into the cold water. Big Red got up on the bank. I tried and tried to get there too, but I could not. My feet were cold. My hands were cold. Help! Help! I called. But Big Red could not help me. Then I saw something on the other bank. Something in the trees. It was Little Black. He saw me in the water. Help me, Little Black, I called. Help me. You can run on the ice. You are little. The ice will hold you. Little Black looked at me. He looked at the ice, and then his head went up. His tail went out. He was not sad anymore. Here was something he could do. Little Black came. He came to me over the ice. Come on, boy, I called. You are going to make it. Little Black got to me. He let me take hold of his tail. Then he pulled and pulled to get me out of the water. Then he pulled and pulled to get me up on the ice. Would the ice hold the two of us? The ice did hold. And on over the ice we went. Little Black pulled me to the bank of the river. Good boy, I said. You saved me. Now Little Black put his head up high. My, he was happy. At last he had done something Big Red could not do. That night, all my friends came to see Little Black. We were all as happy as he Little Black, I said, there is no horse like you. You are the best of all, and I will ride only you from now on. <laughs>